Hey guys, it's Cody Hickman, chef of 360 Catering Events. It's Bittersweet Chocolate Day. Man, we've just been having so many chocolate days. We've done the cherries. Now we're doing fudge. Who doesn't love fudge? A little, little walnuts on top. What we're doing, as you see already, we got our pan ready. Very good tip for you. Spray the inside of the pan so when you put the portrait paper in there, it seals it, spray the pan again, spray the parchment paper on top. It'll seal that in so when you pour the chocolate in, you won't have your parchment paper fall in. And it'll be a nice little consistency on the outside. So let me take you over to my double boiler. As you know, we've done a lot of chocolate, so I think you've got the double boiler down it already. So we got a nice smooth consistency on our chocolate. Looks just absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna put these way and we'll take the chocolate over here go all right so we're going to take this beautiful chocolate over here and pour it in our parchment paper very slow we want to get about an inch of chocolate in there the great thing about chocolate being melted this way it's gonna obviously even out perfectly. You wanna make sure your consistency is good. So see how my toothpick just stays right in the middle and stays straight up. That means you got a great thickness for your fudge. That's about an inch thick. We're now gonna put our, our uh, chopped walnuts on here and just be generous. No reason to save the walnuts. I'm kind of the nutty chef, so I like a lot of nuts. And all we're gonna do is refrigerate this for four hours or overnight. Just kind of depends on how you want it to do it. Depends on how hungry you are for your fudge. The magic of TV, of course. We have our finished product. Nice and solid. See how it's not swashing or anything. Stay overnight. That's why you do the parchment paper in there. Fill it all out. Just let it slide on out. And cut a nice big piece for myself. to add just a little powdered sugar. Well again, this is Cody Hickman with 360 Catering Events. You can find all the portion sizes and full recipe on 360cateringandevents.com. Until we see you next time, enjoy.